God is in control. That's why we always have reason to give thanks in every kind of situation. So enjoy prayer and thanksgiving only here on Let's, Let's Pray, Pray Filipinas. Ayong Adlao, mga kapaglaong, we are so happy to be with you again. We are also happy. And throughout the week, abot na gina ang Friday and it's Thanksgiving Day. And yes, this prayer program is for those who are um, sad and for those who are happy, for those who are worried and for those who are assured. This is for everyone and this is for you. Yes, for everyone. ER, matatay, ate, kuya, bunso, lola, lolo, auntie, and also to our mothers, mga nanay nato, dira, no, nagalantaw, pinaagi, sa atong local antenna channel 25, Parasat Cable Channel 17, and our nationwide coverage, GSAT Cable 33. So, maayong buntag sa atong tanan. Yes, Ate Shan, and this is for everyone. So, it's not just for the Philippines, it's for yes. the whole world. <laughs> exactly. So, we have our Facebook page, www.facebook slash Let's Pray Filipinas. So, yes, mga kapagam, you can type there, you can comment, you can like, you can react, and especially you can share so that we can reach more people to be happy with us this Thanksgiving Day. Yes, and also mga kapaglaom, I would like to note this, yeah. I was told, no, our lines have always been open. Kaning yeah. mga number nga makita ninyo sa inyuhang screen, 24-7 you can call and text. However, for the next 30 minutes when you call, it will be on air. Pwede ninyo ma-share wow. ang mga palalangin, pasalamat dira sa ginoo. Mo na for TM and Globe subscribers, you can text or call 916 Five five seven four seven 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 and for glo um TNT and Smart zero nine two nine three four four one seven seven seven. Mo nan tawag na mga kapaglaom. Yes, Atishan. So we are very excited to hear from you. And yes, before we hear your Thanksgiving or your mga prayer requests, yes. we because it's Thanksgiving Day, de ba? Mm -hmm. We also have Thanksgivings mga give what sa ginosa to uh, this time. Yes, no, uh, I mean, God has been grateful. Yeah, yeah. It's May 11 already, and He was able to sustain. Ako personally, no, mm. for sustaining, I'd like to, for my family, for their understanding, and also sa kung brother na nagkaanam anam nagka better ang iyahang health. So I'd like Amen. to praise God for that. And it's a celebration, it's a Mother's Month, and I've read na mga posts, mga pang hinumdom sa atong mga inahan. So, mao nang maang influence bito sa imo RK. Ma good vibes bud siya. Ma okay. Makapalipay good vibes siya. And Amen. for you? So, mothers, yes. For me personally, you know, I've been praying to God, no, for asking for a motor para sa delivery. Ayo. Yeah, don't okay. Every day, did you may mo nga. <laughs> Mag bike in town. Gid may tabo nga wala ko exercise di siya. Kay ini ka auto, bay kun jud na ko na ang tibo kagani pa tibo. So, that's one thing nga gi provide sa Ginoo. And praise now, the Lord. Yes, praise and the our Lord. kapaglaoms, naapod sila, mag-share nga praise reports yeah, are. Right. Magsugod uh. ko, gikan kay Remy Imer Ramzals, nag-chat siya sa ako personally to pray for um, Rene Gingging, nga na siya heart surgery. I think it was about Wednesday. And mga kapaglaom, um, si Ma'am Gingging, she was in happiness also and thanksgiving that she was, uh, he was able to successfully nga naka survive the surgery and now on recovery na dra sa CUMC. So praise the Lord. Okay, so diri po, nagikan kang Jessel Gimalan. Iyang anak atong gyan po itong yes. niya. Gito, okay, three years, three years old, old pa siya. Nga, on sa to siya, nasa in infection sa dugo. Na, UTI. So, so probably gila mm. natin siya. But we praise God nga nag-send again sa message. This morning, good morning, let's pray Pilipinas. Thank you for the prayers for Jan Jan Resurrection, he is okay now. God is really amazing. Then that's very true. God that, is amazing. Yes, again. and we like thank you for your prayers. Yeah. We'd like to thank God, good for this opportunity to be able to pray with you. And having that mentioned, let us start our program with a thanksgiving prayer. So, mga kapaglaom, let me start our. Let us pray. 
Dearest Heavenly Father, we are very thankful, dear Lord, for this another day, for this another moment that we can go back to you and praise you and thank you for all the things that you have done for us and not just for us, dear Lord, for our Kapaglaum, especially for, for uh, Sir Remy and the family of Ging Ging. Thank you, dear Lord, for giving him the strength the doctors also for giving them the wisdom that for his body also to survive, dear Lord, the said operation for his heart. Father, thank you because in this situation, they are seeing you more in their lives. They are seeing the reality that you can really be there whatever, whenever. Thank you very much for being a loving God and the one that can heal all classes of diseases. In Jesus' name we pray. Yes, dear Father, indeed, we have so much to thank you for. You have done so much in our lives. And yes, Father, we thank you for answering our prayers. We thank you for providing what we need and what we ask from you. Heavenly Father, here also we are thankful together with Giselle that you have answered her prayer para siyang anak na si Jess, para siyang anak na Jan Jan Resurrection. Dear Father, we thank you for giving him back the health, the the energy that he needs dear father and lord we thank you for healing him from infection and from UTI so father we believe now dear god we believe again that everything is possible through your name and when prayer requests come again we can come to you and we can believe dear father that you are indeed listening and we also thank you father that you are hearing this prayer that we are giving to you now and you are not just hearing but you are preparing answers for whatever prayer we have we ask all this and we thank you in Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. Thank you, mga kapaglaom. And so, padayon sa inyong pag-send sa inyo ha, mga praise reports. And, our, having that mentioned, we have yeah. a caller on the line, Ma'am Janeline Orasyon. Good morning. Good morning, Ma'am. Hi, Ma'am. Um, gikan yes. sa Bukid nun, right? Yes, Ma'am. Dagumbaan particular. Okay. So, Ma'am Janeline, welcome to Let's Pray Pilipinas. How can we pray with you? Uh, magpa-pray lang tak ma'am mm. sa business na mo nga kakastart pa lang unta uh, nga patuloy ang blessing sa ginoon mo nga ang ginoon tak pray may mag-una sa mo uh, at saka sa akong mga kids nga ilang health mm-hmm. kaya gagmay pamagot sila ma'am yes ma'am uh, thank you for calling happy mother's day no? yeah. <laughs> yes it's a mother's month so thank you na Ari hangi pa pray kay ang business and also second kay the health of the children. So can you pray for our sure. mother nga so caller? Ma'am, ma'am, ma'am Jinaline Orason from Bukidnon. Okay, ma'am Jinaline, it's also uh, kaning very good nga insight nga when we start a business, let God be the exactly. first. Oh, let okay, God the start pa day ano, oh, business. Starting pa business. So let God lead. So let us pray, ma'am. Heavenly Father, thank you so much, dear God, for this opportunity to pray again, to come to you. And here is Mom Janeline with us, dear Father, on the line. We thank you that um, she realized, dear Father, that she's starting this business with you. And first, dear God, it's you who gave this opportunity. So I pray that you will give them wisdom. I pray that you will give them guidance. And I pray, Father, that you will be the one to guide them and to guide their every decision in business, that it will all be for your glory closer to you. Thank you, Father, for this blessing and we thank you too that you will bless their family, you will help their family to stay healthy, and you help their family also, their Father, to continue to trust in you and to grow spiritually. Thank you for hearing this prayer. We ask all this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you, R, and thank you, Ma'am Jinalin. And so, mga kapaglaom, dugang nga uh, pasalamat pag yun, reasons for pasalamat. Of course, abin yung nalimtan, no? We have a quote of <laughs> yeah, the day. Yeah, wala yun wala yun ni siya nalimtan. R, can you share the quote of the day or a question of the day that can help us mm. ponder more about our topic this okay. Friday morning? So, here it is, mga kapaglaom. Let me read it. Indeed, is not the Sabbath, one of the greatest blessings ever given to our race. What would the world do without it? Try to see the world right now. Okay. And you will see three-fourths of <laughs> what the world would really be without yes. even just one who will keep the Sabbath. Because we see nga now, we see now nga not we, we 
we have not kaning really given the, the, Sabbath, the Sabbath its kanang importance we have not really given it is ano so we see unsa epekto nakita na to karon we because the Sabbath was made for us to remember diba the to creator. remember our creator mm. it was it was the last day of creation i mean humana ang creation uh, now on the seventh seventh day god was like i rest now mm. because i see that everything is now good so we see there nga for the six days god had been working mm. he had na diba last man pagyud ang humankind so iha pag yung provide an og pagkaon so if we spend the sabbath day first things yeah. first is to remind us diba remember the sabbath day yeah. to keep it holy it is to remind us that mm. god is it's our, our creator. ultimate mm. creator good and so provider. We see also God's ownership. Na siya ang atong guide, siya ang tanan. So when we forget that, yes. Oh, when we forget that, I mean, na magyapu yung makarundo. But when we forget that, what happens when we do our own thing? Diba? we were discussing that oh. previous mga days nga. If we just follow what we want to do, gubuto kay lebutan kay one wants this, the other wants that. Yes, and and, and the thing po nga stress ka yung yun ta ar kung magdilit ta maguna huna na nade ginoo na naglalang nagbuhat mm. magprovide stress kaya tao okay. all things will just come from us mingon tag ako mangita ko pagkaon ako oh. mangita ko kuan ako mga anak nagsakit ako panis lang matayan ako manina hospital it's very chaotic okay we're putting things on our hands That's in the right. first place mo na natong life murag mm. ako ani buhat na ako ani buhat and, and as we see now mogen and even in the physical thing, diba? we see that this is the last nga, when we don't have the Sabbath, one whole week mag work. Oh. And that would be. Muna siya, may may tabo, exactly. Diba? And so we see there the, import, the, the, the concept of what the world will be or it is now. Kung wala yud ang adlong ipapahulay and are, yes. Yes, so <laughs> mga pagkakaong atong balikan kini after we answer this caller from Oroqueta City, Darrell Dablo. Hello, my buntag. Hello, sir. Sir, sir Daryl, welcome to Let's Pray Pilipinas. Sir? Hello? Hello? Oh, sir, Hi. yes. Good. Perfect. Yes. Sir, welcome to Let's Pray Pilipinas. Hello? Hello, hello. Yes, sir. Um... Unsa na uh, pwede na mo makuha ang imong concern para sa prayer request? Uh, prayer request na mo ma'am mm -hmm. si Pastor Johnny Kalibo. Johnny Kalido? Kalibo. 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 Okay. Opo. Okay, sir, unsay nahita po, sir? Ah, uh, do na say dibate ba? Eh ang panglawas. Um, diabetes. Oh, diabetic. Mm. Oh. Okay. Mm -hmm. Naabo siya karon sa hospital? Ma'am? Naa siya karoon sa balay? Sir? Hello, ma'am. Oh, Aaha siya karon sir. Naa siya sa hospital? Naa sa iyan ang balay. Ah, naa sa balay. Si Pastor Johnny Kalibod? Ano niya si Sir Johnster? Ha? Ang yung anak. Ah, iya, yeah, good day ni Papa. Okay. Ah, okay, uh, so Papa, good day ni ni Sir Johnster na amo ang um, uh, um, ato ang yeah, branch God. manager de rin. So, iapil na to si Pastor Johnny Kalibod o iapil po na to si ato ang audio man karon nga si Shoti Ngagi Hilantan. So, I'll pray for Pastor Johnny and then you can pray for Shoti. Atong kaoban okay. nga volunteer. And for the health also sa Jensen nga, ay mo sa Jensen nga team. Ilahang safety. Ah, okay. O, kaya mag later. So, mga kapaglaom, let us bring this to God. Let us pray. Our Heavenly Father, dakwa mo pagpasalamat amahan kay makaanha may dira kanimo bisag unsa nga panahon ug bisag kinsa man ug bisag unsa man galing ang ilahang concern kay nakita namo nga bisag diri ay diri sa pagampo amahan pwede mi magkahiusa pwede mi nga nay isa ka identity tungod nagatuo mi nga ikaw makagagahaw Father Among i-appeal sa pinasahi sa pag-ampo si Pastor Johnny Kalibod nga adunay ginabati na siya ay diabetes dear Lord o makita na mo nga 
ang concern so ni sir no nga sa iyahang kahimtang karon father among gina ampo nga imuhang ipakita sa iyaha ang giya imo ipakita sa iya ang kahaya kung unsaon man galing maka, makakita silang mga tao nga makatabang pud pero labaw sa tanan ikaw nga amo ang magbalanta the ultimate healer dear lord so we pray nga sa inaning nga sitwasyon magkahiusa pud sila sa pagampo ug kanunay kami po dire sa let's pray that on kini nga concern dira kanimo daghang kay salamat sa pagtubag sa among mga pagampo and yes lord we also pray for one of the volunteers here shoti is not feeling well dear god and he has fever so i pray father that you will show him the reason why and also show him unsa ang buhaton para maayo ni either through the doctor or whatever your father but i pray that you will heal him very soon we also pray for the safety of our volunteers who will go to jensen we ask for safety nga sa ilahang way there their father no nothing evil will happen nothing bad will happen your father and especially we also pray for the safety of their souls that they will continue to bring you in their hearts their father wherever they go and they will glorify you and they will be a blessing to the place where they will go in jesus name we pray amen amen thank you kaayo for our caller and also our for praying so mga kapaglaong padayon sa pagsend padayon sa inyong pagtawag and also we'd like to take note no di ba gidiscuss na to what would the world be, be without, without the sabbath now what would the world be with Kering na na gi sabat na atong ginakip. It's full essence, and we have ER will show an illustration later after the short break. Some loves come and go, but this one is for real. I am loved. I am broken. I need help. I need a savior. Jesus, give me the power to change. No more excuses, Lord. I confess I have sinned. Jesus, I am yours. Jesus, I accept your offer of salvation. Thank you. Jesus, I love you and I want to obey you. I can't believe it. I'm growing in Jesus. Jesus, I will be your hand and I will be at your service. Thank you for the love letters. 24-7, 365, I'm connected to Jesus. For my doubts, I have an anchor in Christ. There is joy in this journey. This is the happiest I have been in my life. Discover, renew, and grow together as we explore Steps to Christ. Read Steps to Christ again for the first time. Welcome back, mga kapaglaom, and so... We would like to share this again, no? Sa ato mga kapaglaom out there. Um, are you have an illustration? Nava first, on the first part, we talked about nga. Maunsa ka ang kalibutan ng walay adlong ipapahular. Now, maunsa ka ang kalibutan ng atong mga kinabuhi kung na ay adlaw ipapahular. <laughs> so, this is atong balikan ng Creation Week. At yes. Like when the Sabbath was created and when the whole world was great. So let me hold okay, your so mic. Hold that mic. Thank you. So on the in the beginning God created the heavens and the earth. So here we see the whole week, no? Seven days. Not a seven uh, So we have literally. seven that's ah. here. This is supposed to be actually white. <laughs> pero delicious white. Yeah, so nine so, four C E R. So on okay, the first so on day. On the first day God made light. So he poured Clean water on the first day. Clean, purified water on the first day. And God said it was good. And on the seventh, second day, God created this and that. And God said it was very, very good. And the third day, very good again. 
And the fourth day, very good gapon at in perfect, nothing wrong with it. And the fifth day, and until the sixth day, man, that was, yeah, us. And wondering why I didn't put the water on the seventh day. On the seventh day, God did something very special. Exodus, yeah. So here, God gave something very special. This is grape juice, pure, yeah? And He rested on the seventh day. So and this is where God stopped? God stopped. Oh, so rested from His creation. Yeah. He saw it was very good already. Yeah, it was all very good. And here, God rested and He hallowed it. Okay, he sanctified or hallowed, hallowed he it, made it holy, holy, and he blessed the seventh day. Here we see, no, God gave very special blessings on the seventh day. Everything was good. Everything is good. Like we can enjoy water, we can enjoy every day. But on the seventh day, God gave something. Gatag sa ginunga something we can enjoy. More than we enjoy water, more than we enjoy. So, Atishan, this oh. is for you, oh. Atishan. Tell. <laughs> Ako adeni, okay. So, so, we see here, mga kabaglao, no? It's look at Atishan. Okay. Enjoy this. So, as we see, it's it's. I'll taste it. <laughs> okay, cameras on Atishan. Tell. Mm. Wow, more. <laughs> Lips see, up. once you taste it, you'll want more. Okay. You'll want more because. Unlike water, nga plain man yun ang taste sa water, no? So, for, makita na to, nga for the past few, uh, for the six days, manumingo now, you can work, yeah. you can play, you can do mm. this and that. But on the seventh day, this is a very special day for you, Mangit. for me. It's very special. You will, you'll have to s taste it for yourself para ka makaingon nga special day That's siya. That's right. So we have to taste it gin makabla. No, this is just one glass. I can't give it to you. But yeah. you know, uh dili gani ma share nitisan sa ko kay kulang <laughs> in the volunteers, but we know God has given the Sabbath for men. It was not for a specific group. It was not only for the old people like kanya yeah, adto. Like sila nga the Thomas time sa mm. Israelites. No, it was during the creation yeah, week. Yeah, that's right. Wala pay wala pay race, wala pay Kindred, wala pa kingdoms, mm. wala pa. It was all plain humanity. Yeah, and that's it was right. given for us. So yeah, it says in the Bible no, in Luke that the Sabbath was made for men. Man. So Yes. Money money siya mga kapaglaom ang kanang by faith but ako, on the seventh day, dili man blue ang sky, yellow ang uh, sun. It will be just like as normal day, but every minute, every hour of it is holy That's made holy by our heavenly father so what's one blessing at ishan nga imong na na receive imong na kanang experience during sa sabbath day during the sabbath day it it it's a reminder nga ang ginoo gyud maoy mag mo say tag yes ako mm. bang i don't have to kay makita nimo bang batan on worried na kay mag unsop ko ang akong life and uh, i don't have to really struggle that much Okay, I'll see nga, He holds my life. And every Sabbath, He reminds me that I am beautiful and He created mm. me in that way, in His purpose too. So, one yeah. siya ang, one we of the have the same kanang blessing that we receive. Aside from physical blessing, no, nga, nine times nga kapoy kay throughout the week, pagabot to Friday, then, yung go, Hey Lord, salamat yun. Kay, <laughs> oh, di ni pa Sabado ogma. Siyempre, nagi isugo sa imo ha, nagi kay buhaton. But aside from that physical thing, the spiritual blessing that yes, we receive. Yes, exactly. Ba? The spiritual blessing. It's really amazing. Uh, I mean, when <laughs> can you have, we are sure, God, God promised, no, uh, we, as the Gentiles who seek, unsa um, um, akong suoton, at the unsa akong kaunon, kaunon um, ah, akong matulog. On the Sabbath, it, we are reminded, no, uh, seek ye first the kingdom Nama of God, God and, and oh, all these yes. things will be added unto you. Gignan me one time, nga. Uh, sa katong isa ka business nga person gig namin nga uy unsa man mo nganong sabado kay business wala mo sila. oh na mag na may business nga gamay di ba unsa man mo nga sa sabado nganu mo siraman mo tapos mo ni isa sa pinaka dako nga kanang ting ting pangwarta <laughs> but you earn more than money yeah, you earn more than right. money and so mga kaplag paglaom 
have this be in your mind. And so we will read a few of the prayer requests that we still have here in the air. So, gika ni siya. Ako ning pagabasaon. Gika ni siya kay Sir Saturn J. Rivas Sandaya. Good morning. Let's pray Pilipinas. Please pray for my lovely wife. Happy Mother's Day, no? Ma'am Jane and cute baby Lanin who are in President Rojas, North Cotabato right now. Yang note are, I miss them much. Wow. And then another one That's from cute. Eve Nyandiko. Please pray for my God, so ministry. Flying back to the Philippines to bring the message of Jesus Christ. Please pray for this ministry. Satan is working his counterfeit. So, ato ning apa sa pag-ampo mga kapaglam. Imuha ar? Okay, this is from Dodong Ken Lawrence Cato. Please pray for my wife. She is confined at Valencia Sanitarium daw due to her kidney problem. And from Francis Joey. Hi, here I am again. Magpatabang na po ko ang ampo. This coming May 14 na ami youth convention sa Davao. Hataga nun tami og maayong pagbiyahe. Og daghan po nun tami mga kauban. Og masuplayan ang tanan in terms of financial. Okay, so mga kapaglaom, let us pray. Dearest Heavenly Father, we are thankful, dear Lord, that we can bring these petitions now to you, but also, even if off-air, we can pray Amen. continually. Father, we have your Sir uh, Tandayag who misses his family already, yahang wife, okay, yahang daughter. We pray, dear Lord, that you will create opportunities um, dili na sa madugay that they can be together again. And we would like also to pray for Eve Nyandiko, who will be traveling here for in the Philippines for his ministry, for her ministry. I pray, Father, that you will be able to sustain her, not just the ministry, but the people that she will be serving here in the Philippines, and that the Holy Spirit will work in each heart. In Jesus' name we pray. Heavenly Father, we pray for Dodong Kato. Yang wife ng sick karon di gar nasa sanitarium. We pray, Father, that she will remember that you are the great doctor, and she will allow you to heal her. So whatever way that you will provide, dear Father, and we also pray for this uh, coming youth convention. We are praying for them that you will keep them safe, and they are praying especially for financial blessing para ma provide and tanan. Especially, I pray that you will be with them, you will guide them, you will give them wisdom that they will learn of you and they will know you more through this convention. We ask all this believing in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much, mga kapaglang, for those who called, for those who texted. Just keep it going. No, and also this Sunday, this coming Sunday is a Mother's Day celebration. So let's pray, Pilipinas. So we have a special segment for our mothers, for the children. So please watch. Join us in praying for our mothers. And also, mga kapaglang, before we go, we just, I just like to again, no, we discuss about what would the world be without it. So yeah. the Sabbath really is for us. And I cannot say nonetheless, but come and join us in tasting what the Lord can do for us. Yes, it is. So mga kapaglang, this is what God wants e each of us to hear in Deuteronomy. No? I present to you life and death. I present to you good and evil. I present to you the Sabbath versus will I rest? So God is asking us to choose life, yes. to choose happiness, and to choose rest in Him. So mga let's enjoy this blessing together with your prayer partners. Let's pray Pilipinas where you don't have to pray alone. If you have been blessed by this program, share hope and help us continue to bring hope everywhere. Send your donations to South Philippine Union Conference through any of the bank details shown here. Hope Channel. Sharing love, changing lives.